Morning guys, Harry here. Um, as most of you probably know that were on Twitter last night, or uh, those of you who follow me on Twitter, uh, I was keeping people updated as to the reason why I didn't have any content out yesterday, uh, for which I apologise. Uh, basically, I was uh, taken into hospital last night. Nothing serious or anything like that. But there's a lot of irony surrounding the reason why I ended up in the hospital and there's, you know, and the significance between that and this, the nature of this video. Basically what happened was, yesterday I was at the top of our stairs and I have to be very careful walking up and down stairs in any case and I just kind of took a tumble and rolled down the stairs uh, because of my spinal fusions in the past and the fact that I've got like pins and stuff like that holding my spine together I was in a lot of pain I couldn't move at the bottom of the stairs but as a precaution you know anybody normal had have taken a tumble down the stairs it had just been checked over and that would have been it but because of all the metal work I have in my spine they had to um, keep me in check over MRI scans uh, stuff like that there and obviously upgrade my uh, medication and stuff so that's the reason why I'm a little bit drowsy I'm not really supposed to be doing videos or anything like that but Vicky's t uh, gone over to her mum's so I've quickly set it all up so I can make a video anyway like I say there's irony surrounding this yesterday I was going to make the video that I'm making now and the video that I'm making now is about this new technology that's come out for spinal pain. Now that I seen this on the news a couple of nights ago and I thought you know that would be great to do a video about because I was going to do it on my blog but then I thought you know there's a lot of technology surrounding this particular um, pain relief so I thought well I'll just do it on my YouTube channel and put it onto Tech30 as well. So basically what this is there's this new technology out and it it's a it's come from the iPhone and the the Wii you know the um, accelerometer that type of thing basically what it is in your spinal column where, where people have chronic back pain like myself a lot of it is uh, memories of signals that are being sent from the the area of pain up to the brain uh, and those those signals are constant and they need to kind of like have a break in those uh, signals there is a lot more technicality to it than that but obviously when somebody hurts their back because of the nature of how close it normally is to the spinal column and so forth it's nearly 80% of the time it's permanent in one way or the other not necessarily the uh, this, this the level of pain but it's permanent so a doctor in um, I think it's uh, Cambridge here oh St Thomas Hospital in London has come up with this fantastic new way of dealing with the pain and basically what they do is they open your back and they push a rod right down the side of your spinal column. Now, I've had something. And by the way, while this is happening, you're awake. Obviously, you're you're, you're numb. Your back's all numb and stuff like that. But you can feel it going in because I've had this done before. Uh, a discography, it was called. And you've got to lie on your belly and you've got to be awake. And they push it in and they touch around your nerve uh, and your spinal column and all sorts of weird things happen. Like your legs will start flipping. You'll lose complete sensation, you'll wet yourself or that type of thing. You completely lose all feeling and sensation from your waist down. And so needless to say, it's not really a pleasant experience. However, with this particular surgery as well, it's the same type of thing. You're kind of awake uh, so that they can make sure that they're putting this in correctly. Now, obviously, there's a hell of a lot of danger involved in this because they're right by the spinal column. Anyway, what happens is, the tube goes in, and that's it. They stitch you back up again. Now, this tube sends electric pulses 
round the spinal column. Now here's where the technology of the iPhone type of... Uh, it's got nothing to do with the iPhone, but it's, it uses the technology that's in the iPhone with the accelerometer. It can sense when you're standing and lying uh, or kneeling or you know lying on your side, that type of thing. And when it does that, it, re it releases the, um, the signal strength to alleviate the pain from lying in that area. Now I'm putting some images up at the minute and you can have a look through and the images will maybe explain it a little bit better. But the device that they, the, there's a little device that they'll leave inside you. Now, I mean I got, I'm like a building site inside me in any case because I've got pins holding my spine together so they'll probably just hook it onto there like a little coat hanger or something like that. But, Vicky and I were talking the other day about whether I should go and see the doctor to try and have this done. Uh, I would be a prime candidate. There's only been a, a couple of people in the UK have had it done, from what I'm led to believe. Uh, but I would be a prime candidate because my pain has been so long and there's been so many complications with it. But the only thing that frightens me is the fact that it's you know it's right by the spinal column and obviously slightest little mistake and I know I know I've been told by my surgeons that within the next five years, five to ten years, possibly less, possibly a little bit more, I will end up in a wheelchair. So, but if I can prolong that inevitability, then I will do. So going to have this surgery frightens me a lot. But for people out there that don't that are in back pain, uh, maybe didn't see the news bulletin or don't know about it it's definitely something to to take a look at go and see your doctor and find out what they think about it i'll put links up to the um the doctor that's kind of devised this come up with this and uh all the information about it and everything will be down below in the little in this new box thing you know it's not on the sidebar anymore so that's it guys that's where the irony of this comes you know i was on my way to make a video about my spine and then all of a sudden I take a tumble so and I also want to say thank you very much for every single person that sent me tweets and stuff like that there you know wishing me well uh, you must you must think that my family's falling apart at the seams here you know Vicky is going through some stuff at the minute uh, with relating to a tumour she had removed from her appendix and half of her bowel removed a couple of years ago and now this happens to me and you know as usual, poor Vicky's left to deal with all the care and all the rest of it when she's dealing with things herself, so it's crazy. Also, uh, just to finish the video off, I got the uh, the iPod Shuffle for the winner of the giveaway that I had on Tech Planet 30. Uh, the person who asked, or the person who won it asked for a green one, so it w I was going to get it posted today, but I'm not allowed out. So I will get it posted tomorrow. Uh, if I don't do it, Vicky's definitely going to be doing it because uh, she's only working half day tomorrow. So your iPod Shuffle is on its way, mate. Uh, I'll send it recorded delivery, like I said. So thanks very much, guys, for uh, tuning in, watching. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Go across Tech Planet 30. There's loads of other ways there that you can follow me. Uh, and... Um, also over in iHarson30.blogspot.com uh, if you're getting a little bit bored with all the tech. So thanks very much guys and see you all later. Bye.